What's up YouTube? How's everyone doing? Welcome to another video. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Comment me your favorite activity, your favorite hobby. What do you like to do when you're not working? For me, it's like a mix. I guess working out probably, even though work is very working out related, but I enjoy working out when I'm not at work as well as reading and listening to financial and educational videos so I, I like learning when i'm not at work you know whatever i could watch whether, whether it be a video read a book just to spark um something in my brain that wasn't there before you know um so yeah today was a beautiful day at work uh lady had a bunch of extras as you know i get commission off the extras she had a thousand dollars in extras which is seven hundred three hundred and seventy five dollars that i make off of that alone um which is why i'm very hungry at charging people extra because i make commission off of it uh but it's not like i make shit up they actually have these extra items and i just offer to take them all and i word it very well so they want to do it uh we also got a good tip we got 50 dollars a man so that's 425 just in that and then my hours were 300 so I made $725 today. Good day at work. It is 7 o'clock. I went in at 7, 12 hours. I don't know what that comes out to an hour, but it's pretty uh, pretty nice. So that's what happened today. Um, besides that, I brought my own lunch to work today, so I spent $0. So that entire $725 is going in my pocket. Um, I didn't give any to Chipotle or Wendy's or Burger King, Taco Bell. It's all for me, my money. Those franchises don't get any of it. And now I could do what I want with it. I could invest it. I could go buy groceries, which I need to do because I need to be able to bring more lunch tomorrow. Um, and yeah, it's an extra. I probably would have spent 20 something dollars today. So in a week's time, working every day, it's, it's like 150 to 200 bucks. I spend a week in food if I'm eating on the truck every day, and that's a lot of money, you know? That's essentially going out to eat with my girlfriend once a week that I spend throughout throughout the week on food. So I'd rather buy that food at the grocery store and spend about 80 bucks and have enough food for the week rather than spend 160 at work and yeah you know i don't get to save that extra 80 to 100 dollars plus i wouldn't be eating as healthy so that's what i did today that's what i worked on um yesterday i took a nap that ended up being just a full-on sleep you ever do that you go take a nap and you just wake up at like 11 30 and you're like oh my god like i normally go to bed at this time yeah, it was supposed to be a one hour nap but it didn't work out like that so I try not to nap. I did pretty well this month on not napping. I was napping every day. We are a lot busier at work though, so it keeps me more busy, but I'm also trying to just do more things that interest me and work on building myself, you know, and building my future, um, doing these things that will help me in the long run. So that's, that's what I'm working on. Things such as I'm reading a book, watching a lot of videos, working on starting my own business, um, working on the Google page, trying to get leads to come in. I'm also, I haven't done this in a while, but I have a real estate course that I paid for that whenever I want, I could study. I have a year to finish it. I was trying to do it in like a month, but that's a little too much cramming for me, apparently. Um, things like that. Because if I get the real estate license, currently I make about $120,000 a year just at work. Then probably a little less maybe a hundred thousand a year it it fluctuates last year was really good i was making great money last year this year is uh still really good it just fluctuates a little bit um but i get a lot of side jobs out of work which is good which is something i'm trying to focus on getting more like mountain tvs painting houses hanging pictures easy things um that easily i can make a lot of money about a hundred thousand an hour doing that and if I could do one of those a day, it's an extra, at minimum, $700 a week. Um, probably more, I normally make like two, 300 bucks. So 
I could make a lot of money just doing a few side jobs that take me like an hour or two. Um, and eventually I could hire someone to do that for me and I don't physically gotta do it, which would be ideal. Um, so these are the little things I'm working on. That aligns well with my work. I've been thinking if I do things that align well with work, I can make a lot more money. So at work alone, let's say, let's say I make a hundred thousand at work with the side jobs. That's easily another 25,000 a year um, at this current state. And I could bump that up by doing more little things. Um, so I could probably get that to like 50,000 a year. And then if I could start selling houses as well, which I already move houses because I work for a moving company. If I sell about fifty thousand dollars worth of commission a year, um, it would be it would be good money. I'd be doing pretty well for myself. Um, that'd be about two hundred thousand a year. Um, and yeah, that's just really having one job uh, is how I see it. So I'm trying to do things that align with what I'm already doing, and um, you know I. I'm kind of a believer that the more you focus on one thing, the better, better rather than doing a bunch of little things, you're kind of making like a little bit of progress. You ever like load, like you want to load a bunch of apps at once. It takes forever to load all the apps. You know, you got to download one app at a time and then boom, like it loads the quickest, gets done. And then you could use the app rather than you loading four at once. You might spend like a good 30 minutes waiting for all four to load. So focus on one app at a time, one thing at a time and put all your energy into it and you will see the results pretty much you'll get there quicker so that's what i want to talk about today thank you for watching everyone have a great day peace